It's an exciting moment for Kerry. The last year has been incredible. He opened a show at the Secession in Vienna, a solo show. We just opened a big solo show at the National Gallery in Washington, D.C. And next month we're off to Antwerp where his big retrospective will open at the Museum of Contemporary Art Antwerp. It will travel to the Reina Sofia, the Fondation Tapies, and several other European institutions. So being able to exhibit him this season with this new project. It's really, uh, you know, kind of high point of my career. And so this work, it's 99 cent piece, but it has a subtitle that is, is what it costs to produce it, which is $136,000. So it was, it's the 99 cent piece, parenthetically, $136,000 in change. And so that's a part of the larger kind of conceptual project. And so it's these two things. It's what it is, what it looks like, and what it costs to make. Uh, and what the implications of all of those things are. And so, I'm, in a sense, I'm really looking at the way in which the artwork as a commodity kind of announces itself as a thing to be bought. You know, I mean, these works, in a sense, cry out to be bought. Because you say, because I mean, the, the the painting of Red Hot Deal. Like, it is a Red Hot Deal, you know, <laughs> you know, and so this is something that 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 somebody should want, you know, the painting behind you. Why pay more? And so, well, you would pay more for this because it's a painting, you know, that the black painting, black on black painting, is called On Sale Black Friday. So I've taken a lot of these slogans that announce the, the announce the intent announces the intention of a thing to be bought and to address itself as an object that's a part of the, the, the system of commodification and the system of valuation and the system of consumption. I mean, these things announce themselves to be that, but there's something else about them. They're not just plain signs like any other sign you would see in a supermarket or any sign that you'd see in a department store. There's another dimension of the work that participates in a kind of dialogue with the history of painting. Uh, that makes them more than just the sign. And so that's the reason why you would invest more in an object like this than you would in a, in a, in a simple cardboard sign uh, that was made purely for advertising purposes.